Howdy, all round the wheel here. Approaching Orbitus. This planet is very blue, and it's got a cool song. Do, 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 do. I always loved, like, voice samples on keyboards like that. Like, I was like, how do people make a good song out of, like, that Casio human voice that goes like, da, 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 da. But people can do it. People are capable of great things. Like, musicians, musicians especially. Very creative people. I wonder if... You know, the composer for this game, Robert A. Allen, when people think of when people think of Jazz Jackrabbit and like the composer, they tend to think of Alexander Brandon. But I don't think and I think he definitely went on to be the more prolific one as far as video games are concerned. But Oh yeah, that little bouncy thing. Well, I want some rapid fire, so I'm actually gonna whip back around for that. But yeah. People, people tend to associate Jazz Jackrabbit music with Alexander Brandon, but I tend to find, I tend to find uh, Robert A. Allen's tunes far more memorable. There we go. Oh gosh, how did I not lose hip hop just then? Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, these bouncy walls, they are gonna prove to be the bane of someone's existence. Probably mine. Um, boink. Oh, this one is... I was gonna say, this one is... That one is very soft on the bouncy. Boy, the spikes in this level. They look so threatening. Okay, how do I get into there? I need... I want rapid fire more than anything else. I picked up basically every other trinket in this level. But no rapid fire. Until now, it's all mine. Okay, good. I can kind of just leave the button held down. That's what we want. Okay, so this is back in the... Yeah, get back around to where we were. We got time to mess around. This ain't turbo, so... We got some time to... Kind of mess around. This... This is giving... This is giving lemmings to me. You know, that one special level. Uh, a very awesome level. The space worms. You know, those guys. Uh, what's up here? More rapid fire. Don't mind if I do. I was scared of getting hit by the baby turtle for a second. You know what? Jazz Jackrabbit even kills baby turtles. No turtle is innocent in the Jazz Jackrabbit world. Devon Shell has captured Ava Earlong. Therefore, all rabbits must, or all turtles must die. Rabbits have the privilege of getting to ride airboards everywhere. Turtles, turtles are not that cool. Turtles don't get to ride airboards everywhere. Floating hoverboards. You know, it's a real failure of our society that we are not united enough to be able to concentrate all our resources on hoverboards like this. I mean, we've got hoverboards. They're those little rolly things. My son had one. He still breaks it out every now and then for shizzies and gizzies. But hey, check one. But I mean, that's not a hoverboard. I was never really impressed by those hoverboards. I was like, that's not the hoverboard I was promised when I was a kid. I was like, we were promised some real back to the future type stuff. Were we not? I feel really ripped off. I feel really ripped off that we haven't received a lot of things in hindsight that we were entitled to. Adults could not stop arguing long enough <laughs> to give us all the great things that society truly deserved. They didn't leave behind a good world for us kids, you know? I say us kids, but I'm 40. It's my turn to start making the good world. I'll make the good world later. I'm playing Jazz Jack Rapper right now. Uh, how about... Ooh, that's... I was gonna say that's a tricky jump, and then I did it. This is a much more accommodating jump. Let's just grab all four carrots right now. I'm sure that won't bite me in the ass later. That's definitely what you want to be doing. There we go. This is a fun little bouncy segment. Big air. This is how you use lightsabers. Lightsabers should not go... Oh, yeah, those things. Oh, yeah, I forgot how annoying those were. Uh, well, we don't want to jump anywhere where those things spawn, but apparently I can't make any promises. Okay. Okay, make sure nothing is going to kill me. 
Okay, hip hop is hip hop is bugging out. But I'm sorry, man. There's not much I can do for you. Okay, I love I love how they're flush with the floor there. And I love how if you do it right, you can you can just get them one segment at a time. We'll let the bird do it. That's a pretty good strategy. When all else fails, just let the bird do it. That's what the bird is hired to do. Okay, which way do we go from here? Okay, and we just destroyed that whole thing with our shield only to not actually go the right way. I know where the right way is in this case. This is not like a tech noir level maze. We just go up through here. There we go. Hold on. Hang on, Sloopy. Here they come. All right. We got the we got the snakes. The first real threatening enemy here. They just move back and forth and Okay, if I can stay flush with them, though, kind of hard to do, actually. But, you know, I can help out, too. I don't have to let the bird do everything. I will let him do this thing, though. It's probably good for him to do this one. You're only hitting one at a time? Come on. Even I can do better than that. Your trajectory leaves something to be desired, hip-hop. Okay, I can just eliminate you. Oh, no, I thought I could do it faster. Well, now I have to do all the work myself. The hip hops have really good unions. They will not take abuse. None whatsoever. Okay, so I can't just eliminate a whole one as it's coming toward me. There we go. Something like that. There we go. Actually stand a decent distance away from them. Okay, all right. So boom, boom, boom. A lot of bouncing and shooting at the same time. Really hard to check in. <laughs> with your progress on these guys. I think if I position it right, I can maybe fall through this. Oh no, that would not be the one I want to fall through. No, no, no. We want to get out of here with 100% items. Why would I bother killing all the enemies? I almost ran out of time, holy cow. I don't remember if you actually die if you run out of time in Jazz Jackrabbit. You may not run out on easy, but, or you may not die on easy mode but perhaps the others you actually do. I think it may be more just a matter of like, what bonuses do I not get as a result of, as a result of my time running out. You may just get no time bonus, uh, which is, which seems nice to me. Oh man, it's my favorite. I get to hear the shreddy owl. <laughs> that was always my favorite as a kid. An owl with like an owl that was sent through like the internet hate machine. Why do some of these take one hit and some take like four? I am not in understanding here. Maybe it's the stationary ones that take a long time to kill. I mean, that makes some sense. They're just standing there being a hit that you can absorb. I believe if I remember the instruction manual correctly, they are called beholders. Which makes sense, because they got them big old eyes. Kind of scary eyes, actually. That blink cycle was honestly slightly creepy. Uh, where should I go from here to grab some rapid fire that I don't actually need? Because the speed max is out at 10, and I have like 19 at this point. But more launchers will be definitely handy. Can I get in there? I sure can. There we go. Secret passage. You know what more games should do, actually? Oh, hey, hi. Okay. Oh, yeah, this little segment. You know what more games should do? I always liked it in Doom, whenever you found a secret passage and the game told you a secret passage. Like, it got really excited there would be a little segment on the screen. I think Duke Nukem did that, too. Probably, maybe both of them did it. But I'm gonna I'm gonna attribute it to Doom. Yeah, it would always tell you a secret passage, and it's like, ooh, that's exciting. It validates you. You found a secret. That's that's fun. Everybody loves to find secrets. This is the part I remember having slow motion on PC as a kid. Okay, so let's see. 
if I can uh, get in there. No, this is a very finicky little segment. Oh yeah, that's why, because you gotta do it twice. Once is one thing, but okay. There we go. We made it. Oh wow, and a big heal to boot. That's that's very nice. All right, nothing, you're hiding nothing. Well, if you're hiding nothing, that's very suspicious and it looks like you're hiding something. So I had to blast you anyway. All right, I thought I almost just took myself to the end of the level right there, but thankfully just a check. We're doing fine. Yo, no, no invincibility for me, which would have been really good here because this segment sucks. Oh, only one part has spikes though. Another part is perfectly safe. Okay, let's uh, let's try not to. Okay, this is a safe one. This is a bad one. Yeah, there we go. All right, can I slide onto this thing? Can I slide into this thing's DMs without making a scene? Somehow I doubt it. Yeah, I never was. Go, oh, what? No, please, why? Why are you the way you are sometimes, game? This is a very... Yeah, I'm starting to remember... I'm starting to remember some of the worst aspects of this level. Oh, hey, I did it that time. You know, when I didn't have a bird to worry about. That was... Okay. All right. Next one. Just let me on, please. I'm just trying to ride the Purple Diamond Uber Express here. Let's... I love games that are so fast that the camera gets ahead of them sometimes. I always think that's incredibly cool. All right, I think in this big room up here, I think there's, I feel like there's a big wide open room coming up and I feel like it's where the bonus gym is located. So we're gonna have to, oh no, we never found the bonus gym. Oh, well, well, no bonus stage, so it's on to the boss. Let's go. I think I'd rather just get the boss out of the way if I'm being perfectly honest. Level clear. That one is more of a relief than not. Some levels, you put them behind you and you're sad to see them go. That one, there's a lot of bouncy, bouncy, and okay, I think I can just stay here. There's not really any need to get down into the nitty gritty with with uh mr devon shell okay so he can fire rapid fire toasters i don't know how that's fair usually my strategy is to just stand here and can i launch her down onto him no he's hiding in a corner there yeah that's a lot more powerful maybe when he gets down into the as you can see, he's riding an ostrich. Dr. Robotnik would never. But I think when I get down to enough health, I'm just gonna get down there and give him the rapid fire treatment. Like now, maybe. There we go. Got him before he could even get a shot off. I got like 12 shots. There we go. All right, episode two is done. I'll see you guys next time for episode three. Ah, yes, the little cutscene. That turtle looks very dangerous. They're not usually so aggressive, I find. Jazz rocked the three techno planets. Now he must pursue Devin into an all natural, fat free, no preservative area of the galaxy. Very cute animation. <laughs> Get ready to explore Nippius, Jung Rock, and the Temple of the Turtle. I think that's actually episode four, but who's keeping score? Oh, another high score for episode two. This is gonna say nothing but roundy by the end. I can guarantee it. I think, you know, it might be a little tough, but I think I can get over 10,000 points in each episode. What do you think? I don't know, seems like a tall order.